Welcome back to the channel and today we are back in our Crashlander survival experience and we've got to bring eight logic gates and six timers back to Mark. But more importantly, I got to figure out what a glow crawler is because apparently this game has been updated and added these glow crawler things and there's a new drill type uh, probably in the metal bench. Yeah, where apparently an enhanced drill uses a glow crawler skutes to build. I need 20 of these. So glow crawler enhanced drill connect the chemical container and button to and button to it to trigger a small explosion at the tip that apparently takes five chemicals per explosion now i got a bunch of ideas right now about just our path up for this episode so first on the agenda is to obviously turn in the logic stuff to mark gonna get a whole bunch of beeswax for that which is really nice because the world my world runs on beeswax um all right, hopefully that wasn't important. But I'm gonna bring all of my crafting benches with me. All of my crafting stuff that I can. So let me pick these things up because uh, if I wanna do more side quests, I wanna make sure I can, I don't have to come all the way back here to craft them. All right, I am also going to take these, all of my chests with me. So this is an output chest, which is where like the metal and the concrete and stuff should go. This is the input chest, which is where all the basic mining materials should go. All right, so let's bring these now i don't know if i'm gonna want my mining vehicle i am gonna be going to a mine what i want to do is i want a chest that specifically has all of the materials for my mining vehicle so what i'm doing is i'm getting rid of literally everything that isn't the mining vehicle and then i do this and now i just put all of this stuff in there so now this is the mining chest oh almost forgot the seat over here oh no I think I may have just made a big mistake because of a, the recent update. I might have to rebuild my mining vehicle. I have to find out. This might not be, I might not be, po it might not be possible for me to rebuild this because my blueprint that I saved had a resource collector in it. But now it is impossible for me to put a resource collector into my inventory. So this, this may have broken my uh my game here so here's my crash lander miner and look at this i can't build it because i don't have a resource collector i just i just deleted my mining vehicle basically um you know what that is why i back up my game before i start every recording i'm gonna reload real quick all right we are back so what i'm going to do what did i name my mining vehicle crash lander miner so i'm gonna override that blueprint with this one crash lander miner save yeah because this one does not have a resource collector in it all right so now i gotta do the thing the stuff i just did all right so now i can click the build button because i have all the materials this does no longer have a resource collector excellent all right so now i can take all my stuff back from this one and i want to paint this mining vehicle gray wait do i not have any paint on me where'd the paint go i thought i had a paint on me does it does a paint tool use paint now Oh, paint tool uses paint now. We no longer have unlimited paint. Oh man, they've made a lot of a lot of updates that make my life hard. All right, so uh, minor chest, put that there. This is uh, oh, that chest is empty now. Okay, so this chest, I got to put these back in. All right, we got our materials. Oh yeah, I need to pick these up again. All right, so here's the game plan. We're gonna go return this quest to Mark. That's gonna be at Forterra HQ. Then we're gonna go into the basement of Forterra HQ. I have a spare chest right here, which is not a vacuum chest. We're going to move all of my water from this chest into the chest that is not a vacuum chest. Because we're gonna use the vacuum chest, we're gonna go into the basement and we're gonna steal a whole chest worth of chemicals. Because I have, I am now carrying a vacuum pipe with me. There we go. Now we've got this vacuum chest, perfect. And I guess I'll put this back over here as my water chest. Actually, I'm gonna paint it blue. No, it's probably gonna get repurposed a bunch of times because it's not a vacuum chest right now. All right, but yeah, so we're gonna go down into the basement extract a whole chest full of chemicals then we are going to go to bills and we're going to accept the glow crawler quest because we need to kill i think 20 glow crawlers or something like that and we also need 20 grow grow glow crawler scutes in order to do uh the enhanced drill which i just want to see what that's like so we go to bill we get that quest then we go to the mine 
We figure out what the glow crawlers are, and then we can come... Oh, then we go back to Bills to return that quest, and then we come home. So that's this episode's plan. Let's see how this goes. So first step, for Terra. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. I can't really bring that stuff with me anymore, unfortunately. I just don't have the space for it. How are we doing on fuel? Oh, we should definitely refuel. All right. Boop. All right. Off to Fort Terror we go. Now, getting to Fort Terror from my home base, I don't know how hard that is. I know getting to my home base from Fort Terror was a nightmare. So let's see if this is a daymare or maybe a dream. I'm going to sleep until daytime, though, so I can see a little bit better. All right, perfect. Off to Fort Terror we go. All right. I've gotten stuck on a cliff again. I just... There's a lot of cliffs between me and Fort Terror, apparently. So I'm going to attempt to bring my vehicle up this cliff like I did before. All right. Mission success. Now, hopefully, it's smooth sailing from here. You know what? Fort Terror isn't that far away from my base. You just have to go straight through the cliffs to get to it. Oh my goodness, look at this. That was insane. Uh, that was awesome. Yeah, it's really not that far. If you guys can't tell by my voice, I am recovering from being a little bit sick. Um, I actually didn't have a voice this morning. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to record today, but I have enough. I'll probably lose it by the end of this recording, but we'll see what happens. Is the chest back yet? Oh, it's not back. The soil bag's still there, though. All right, Mark. I've got some logic for you. All right, Mark, where are you? Mark, Mark, Mark. Hey, there's Mark. All right. Ah, yes, thank you very much. You're welcome. And here is my reward. 50 beeswax. Oh, yeah. Now we can afford all the things. Three large explosive canisters. Okay. Two beacons. 172 copper block. That's not even that much. All right, not impressed with that. All right, let's go back. Let's go down to the basement. How do we get to the basement? I think we got to go up to get to the basement. Yeah, I think to get to the basement, we got to go in here. Am I right about this? Ah, there we go. Yeah, I was right. I just took me way longer to find than I expected. Dang me. Oh, no, I got it. Okay. Right. I thought I was missing the materials I needed for me, but uh, I got everything on me. So I sh we should be good. We're going to have chemicals in no time. All right, I think we got to go this way, right? I think we go into the do not enter where Hank is. There we go. Oh, what's he doing over here? He moved. He used to be over here. Oh, there's a chest over here too. Oh my goodness, I'm actually stuck in the puzzle. Oh, here we go. We got boxes. All right, we got paint, which apparently is important now, and uh, circuit board. All right, let's talk to Hank. What are you doing over here now? These robots always amaze me. All right. Oh, I don't think I ever opened that before. Oh, where did you, wait. Where did he just go? Hank? Oh, he went that way. I thought he went out for a second. I'm like, did I just free Hank finally? All right. Um, wait, aren't there supposed to be chemicals? Where are the chemicals? I thought the chemicals were down there. Hmm. I know they're in one of these rooms. Ah, here we go. All right. Let's see if we can do this. So if I put that... How do I do this? How am I supposed to build underneath? Oh, there's a component kit. Yeah. All right. Oh, here we go. I'll put that right there. And then this right there facing up. And then hook that into that. And there we go. Just wait a few minutes and we'll have a whole bunch of chemicals, which I'm going to have to carry on my shoulder out. Uh, there should be a light switch. I missed a light switch. There we go. Now we can see what's going on in here. So apparently this whole overheated thing, apparently you need 20 water for a single battery, which to me is like... That is outrageous. I don't even know if I want to make batteries anymore. But apparently you can hook up a water container. Like you can just kind of use your connect tool and directly connect the water container to it. So it's not as big of a hassle as I was expecting to get water into it. But yeah, 20 water per battery. What is that? How are we doing? More than halfway done. All right. Looks like we are all full of chemicals. And I guess I have to deconstruct this one piece at a time and then carry this all the way out. Oh, I could go all the way up the stairs. Here, I gotta do this will be the, the quicker method if I do it right. I could potentially lose it though. Alright, I don't feel comfortable doing that in tight spaces like this. I don't want the chest to phase through the walls. Alright. We've made it here. Uh I'm gonna back up my file just in case we have this glitch where the stuff doesn't get transferred out. What do you have again? Oh, he's the one that has bring 
50 glow crawler skewed. Maybe I should just take his quest. Because the whole purpose of going to Bill's was for the glow crawler quest, which I don't remember what the reward was. But this one, I have to bring. I think Bill's was to kill glow crawlers. This is to bring 50 scutes, and I need scutes for myself. But metal three, 256 metal three, that's pretty good. I feel like I'm gonna go with Bill's because that was that was the plan. Let's stick with the plan. Let's see what Bill's was. All right, my game is backed up. Let's go ahead and exit and hope our chest stays with us. Yeah. All right, now we got a whole bunch of chemicals. I need to make some real lights at some point. These torches are so silly. There's our chemical chest. I'm so disorganized with this thing. All right, so uh, that mission is accomplished. Now we head to Bill's house and going to Bill's from here is not so bad. All right, I've successfully made it back to Bill's. Let's hope I was right about his glow thing. All right, something I can do for you? Kill 20 glow crawlers, 128 copper, and 10 component kits. It's okay. 256 metal three might actually be better, but 10 component kits is decent. And, but uh, I feel like killing 20 glow crawlers is probably easier than getting 50 of their scutes. And I need their scutes for myself, so I'm gonna be a little bit selfish in that sense and not give them to... Who was it, Ivan? All right, before I go into the mine though, I am apparently out of uh, milk. Like I only got two more left. So do I have extra corn? I have one corn here. Let me put, look at this beeswax. I got a lot of beeswax now. But some of you are saying that I forgot that I should be using the scythe to harvest corn because I can get a lot more. Now I'm wondering, does that apply to beeswax? Do you get more beeswax if you use a scythe? I don't know how to really tell because beeswax is already like a chance amount. You can get like more or less. Let me go ahead and use my beeswax on this. Well, I guess that answers that. If you can't use it, it probably doesn't actually matter. So I'm actually not going to collect the beeswax though because we have a bunch and I'm not looking to overfill my inventory right now. That's probably a bad idea. I probably should just collect it when I can. But let me go ahead and use the scythe on the corn. It, work it works on the corn. It does. So this is harvestable. Oh, it goes directly. You don't even have to pick it up. Oh, that's so nice. Okay. Okay, this is the way. This is definitely the way. All right, off in this direction now. I like we had we had a really solid plan this time. Like just point by point what we needed to do. And everything's going according to plan so far. This was a bad time to say that. Now that I'm in the forest, I can't see anything. This is where I get ambushed by like five bears. Uh Oh, I was like, I hit something, but I can't see what I hit. All right, we made it out of that forest pretty easy. I don't actually know how far the mine feels like from Bill's. It's been, a, I've only been to the mine once, so I don't have a lot of experience going to and from it. Oh, there's the antenna. All right, the mine continues off in this direction. How far am I from the mine? Oh, I found myself at another cliff dead end. I'm going to go around this one. I feel like... It might not be too big of a detour just going this way. I'm noticing a distinct lack of cows on this journey. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Mm. Here, you eat a couple while I feed you the rest. We can work together on this. Man, I have, this is probably the most I've fed a cow in such a short period. Oh, he's, he's leaving the corn behind. Look at that. Here, one more. All right. How much, how much milk? Nine, five, six. Uh, that's 11 total, and I had two to begin with. So yeah, that was nine. You know what? There's a little bit more corn right here. Let's go ahead and give that cow even more. Imagine if the cows got bigger as you fed them. I would create the biggest cow in the world. All right, we got plenty of milk now. So let's keep heading to the mine. All right, the mine is right here. My house is apparently over that direction. I actually, I feel like I'm not that far away from the mine, which might be kind of nice. All right, so I should probably clear my inventory as much as possible. So I'm gonna deposit my component kits, my paint, I guess will also go in there. I'm gonna put some essential tools that I'm not gonna need down there. I don't think I'm going to need a handsaw down there or like my vacuum pipe and switch setup. I definitely want the double seats. I'll only take five milk with me. I got food, I got drink, I got ammo, and I've got my mining equipment. Oh, headlamp. Let's bring the headlamp with us. Almost forgot, that would've been terrible to forget. All right, I'll keep my helmet on me for whatever reason, just in case I need the extra armor. 
All right, sleep in my bed, make sure I'm gonna spawn here and let's head in. All right, we're in the mines. I don't know what a glow crawler, I don't know what to expect from glow crawlers. I need to turn up my game audio a little bit. Kind of nervous. Oh, I didn't bring any batteries with me. Hold on, I'm gonna bring some batteries. All right, I brought 60 batteries with me. That should uh, give me enough for my hand drill if I ever need, want, really just wanna do some drilling. Okay, here we go. In search of glow crawlers. But I wanna do a little bit of this. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna keep my sword out just in case. Oh, glow crawlers. Where art thou, glow crawlers? Oh. Something just loaded. Like this stuff right here kind of like looks like those red things. Like the, the scutes. Glow crawler scutes. <gasps> I think I found a glow crawler. I don't know what it does. It's coming after me though. Oh. Do I hit it with a hammer? See, what, what concerns me is that it said... It said something about explosions for the drill. So, like, I feel like its horn is gonna explode if I hit him. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna do it. Three hits. That was a critical hit. Four. Five. Six. What? Seven. Just one skewt. Oh, skewt times two. Okay, that wasn't so bad. I do they swarm? Do you think? All right, I'm gonna do something stupid. I'm gonna I'm gonna back up my file and then I'm gonna let the next one. Ju I'm just I'm just gonna not hit it. I'm just gonna let it come up to me and do what it does. I'm in the information collection stage of glow crawlers right now. I don't know anything about them and I I want to see how much damage they do and what kind of damage they do. Oh, I was like, there's a glow crawler. It's glowing. Oh, that's my torch. Is that a glow crawler? I see a glow. <gasps> He's carrying a component kit? This guy's actually carrying a component kit. That's awesome. All right, here we go. Oh, look at that. Look at his attack animations. He's got like a double swipe. Oh, was that like a, a super charge attack? He's got like a double swipe and then he's got like a ground pound. All right, I'm gonna let him hit me, see how much damage he does. All right, here we go. 21 damage? That's more than a bear. Although I don't have my helmet on. Hold on, let me put my helmet on. Wait, uh, can they climb? He's a crawler. He should be able to climb, shouldn't he? Is he coming after me? All right, let me put my helmet on. Let's get full damage reduction. How much damage, does he, how much damage do you do now? 18. 18. He's only doing like a one arm attack. Whoa, 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 what was that? Something sizzled. Did that hurt me? Dang, I didn't look up my health. I don't know if that hit me twice or once. I need to heal a little bit though. I'm gonna hang out out here. All right, you know what? I'm actually just gonna kill this guy. It takes them a long time to die. Oh, I hit the thing off. There we go. Four scutes. All right, that was nice. Okay, let's uh, continue. I don't even know which way to continue. I guess any way really, right? I need 20. I need to kill 20 of these things. That's two I found so far. I see anything glowing down here. I really don't. I think with the headlamp off almost, might be easier to spot them. Oh, look at that. There we go. All right, let me see here. Oh, it does five. If his horn touches you, it does an additional five damage. So that's kind of good to know too. All right, good news is so far, three scutes. Uh, so far, these things are pretty easy to avoid. Like they're, they're pretty easy to manage. You can just keep backing up and their attack animation slows them down enough that you'll avoid their attack just by backing up slowly. So that is good news. I don't know if there's more to them. Like if there's uh, nests or anything, like maybe I just found a couple of lonely ones on the entryway here, but as I get deeper, I don't know if they're gonna have like a whole strength and numbers type thing going on here. All right, we got another one. But seeing one carry something on its back was so unexpected. So deeper into the mines we go. Oh, look at that. So cinematic. I'm now starting to feel like 50 glow crawler scutes is easier than 20 glow crawler kills. Oh, this guy's got copper on his back. Look, there it goes. So it takes like a fewer amount of hits to dislodge what's on their back. 21 copper. Wait, glow? I didn't want glow, I wanted scutes. How many scutes do I get? 13. I should have looked how many. I think it takes 20 scutes to make a drill. So we'll definitely get that before we uh, finish Bill's quest. Look at this guy hiding over in this corner. I'm glad that they emit light. It makes it easier to see them even if you don't have a direct line of sight. Four scutes. All right, that's good. I know we're going to need a handful. 
Oh, where did this one come from? I didn't even see him. Yeah, these guys are easy. I hope that there's like a... I want to find a scute nest. I don't know if that's a thing or not, but... How cool would that be? Oh man, with all the chemicals that we just got... Because the, uh, the crawler... We need to make a chemical container. Because the... The enhanced drill, it... It produces explosions, apparently. And... You need five chemicals per explosion. So... I have a whole chest of hundreds and hundreds of chemicals. All right, I'm halfway there. Uh, so here is the building, which means I know where the drill site is. I'm kind of curious if, it, if there was any place that I would expect... 38? Scram metal from that? Yeah, if there was any place that I would expect a nest of glow crawlers, it would probably be the drill site. All right, so the drill site's down here. There's definitely a glow crawler down there. Looks like just one, not a nest. All right, three scutes from him. Man, I wish I could just take these drills. Can't though. Yeah, it's actually like surprisingly... Well, not even surprised. I don't even know what the expectations were in the first place. But there's not... A, like for the quest, 20, 20 of them is actually going to be a challenge. I'm only 11 and I'm like, I'm down to the drill already. Yeah, I mean, the good news is their glow, like that is all from the, th the, the glow crawler. So it is... It just makes it so much easier to find them from a distance because their glow just takes up so much space, which is really good because I'm having a lot of trouble navigating through here and actually finding the ones, just finding them. Oh, see, look at that. Look at that from a mile away. You can definitely see there's one down there and there's one over here. Well, I don't even think I've, have I been up over here? I don't even know. There was like a ledge over here. It's kind of hard to get. Oh! <laughs> I'm losing my voice and screaming at the same time. All right, and there's another one over there. Man, this is like, I'm going deep into the mines, and I've only... Oh, he's got fuel. That seems like a dangerous combo. He was ready to blow at any moment. All right, three gasoline, three skutes. How am I doing on skutes? 30 skutes so far. I feel like it's actually going to potentially even out quite a bit, where I'll, I'll end up around 50 skutes for 20 glow crawlers. Ah, right, we got another one. I wonder what the respawn rate is on these guys. Two scutes from that one. Whoa. Oh, for a second there, I thought it was a, like a bunch of them, but all the red confused me. What do you have? What is that? Is that raw metal? Yeah, raw metal, 22. Another two scutes. It looks like I'm averaging like two to three uh, per glow crawler. Got any more over here? It's getting harder to kind of see. Oh, okay, I missed you. It's too bright here. There's too many lights. It's hard to tell what's a glow, glow crawler and not. Well, there's got to be another one around here, right? Oh, there we go. Ooh, another component kit. Four from him. Nice. All right, I'm at 18. There better be at least two more, but I'm already, like, at the end. There's one. Are there exactly 20 in the mines? All right, there we go. How am I doing? 30, 50. I got 50 already. But I kind of want... I think I would rather build the drill then give him 50. Here we go. Here is the final one. Wow. It led me all the way to like the final destination of the mine. All right. Two scoots from him. And yeah, I got exactly uh, 20, 20 kills and 52 scoots. So it did kind of all even out. But are there more just a little bit deeper? Let's see if I go this way. Any glow crawlers here? I mean, the quest did kind of feel like uh, he wanted me to clear the mine of glow crawlers. So I guess I kind of did that if there's only 20 in the mine. But we're definitely going to have to come back at another time if we're going to want to do that other quest for Ivan. All right, I'm going to go ahead and head back and uh, we're going to go talk to Bill. We got to get out of the mine first. It's a long way to go. I think I see where a potential... It's like on the other side of this wall here. I can't get over there, though, from here. Is there a pathway through here? No. There's definitely a glow crawler over there. Oh, there's another one over here. I did not find all the glow crawlers. Look at this glowing. Look at this glowing. There are more than 20 after all. Hello there. All right, what are you going to give me? Two? Okay, as long as it's not one. I'd be very disappointed with one. Oh, I think I see two more, three more glow crawlers. Okay. All right. Now, because this is at the beginning. Oh, oh, it's a, it's a trap. These lights confused me. Look at these lights here. Is there a light up there? That has to be a glow crawler up there. I'm assuming it's a glow crawler up there. Ah, yeah, here we go. Oh, is that your... Is that... I thought that was water noise, but listen to the glow crawler noise. That like... So they make... They just emit that noise constantly. Oh, how did I miss this one on the way in? There's another one over here. Wait. 
they had to have respawned. Whoa, oh, the, I went through this, right? Like, this was the way in. I went in this direction. I had to jump through here. They must have respawned already? I don't know. Well, I'm glad to be getting a lot more of these. Maybe after, maybe I'll even have enough uh, extra scutes after the drill. I think I guess I would need 50, 70. So I have 64. If I have 70, I think I can make the drill and complete the quest. This is not going to get me to 70. So there has to be at least a few more. I don't think I'm going to get it. I need three more. One more glow crawler could do it. Also might not. But I'm like close to the entrance now. So I don't think I'm going to find any more. Oh, man. Oh, you know what? I, I know why I missed those. I took this shortcut and there was actually a glow crawler in that shortcut. But I missed that entire area. That's why I didn't see those ones. Makes sense. So yeah, I'm definitely not going to find another glow crawler then on the way back because I have gone through all these areas. Unless I go in this area and find one right here. Yeah. Three. Please give me three. Not two. Not one. 30. 69. Not as nice as it should be. I, need, I needed 70. I needed 70. Is there one more offshoot on the way back? There is. There is. I know where to go. Yeah, right up over here. Oh, there's definitely... There is definitely a glow crawler in here. We're gonna get our seven. There it is. Peeking out right through the hole. Hello. Oh, there's more than one in here. All right, we had more than enough. Look, he gave me three. We've broken over 70 now. Cause yeah, 20 for the drill, 50 for Ivan. All right, we're good. That was a very productive mining trip. We didn't really do any mining, but we did some killing. All right, we've got what we came for. Now we need to go back and tell Bill how awesome we are. Hello, Bill. I've uh, got some good news. I've done some killing. Did I explode them? Uh, no. Am I? Was that? Is that what I supposed to? No, Bill. I'm not as cruel as you. All right. Thank you. 128 copper block. Not great. And 10 component kits. Could have been better. I feel like I feel like you could have done more. You could have done a little bit more for that for me with that one. Come on. All right. Should I do the kill four bears one? No, I shouldn't because uh, it takes a really long time for me to find bears. I don't know where they actually spawn. And I don't want to have that quest just sitting over me when I already have the materials to do the Ivan quest. Uh, but let me head back. I don't know. I'm going to head back home. All right. I can confirm the way back from Bill's <clears throat> is way easier than the way back from Forterra. So I'm glad I didn't go to Forterra first. Although I think for Forterra, I just got to get over that first cliff. All right. Oh, it's so confusing not seeing all my benches here. Let's go ahead and slap them all down. All right, so just to confirm, um, in the metal bench, interactive, yes, we need, I have 75 and we need 20. We also need metal block 2, 30, metal block 3, 20. Here, let's get our chest full of process. We need metal block 3, 20, metal block 2, 30. I have everything I need. Here, this is the output chest for this one, but let me go ahead and take this and this. And let's take a look. Oh, screws. I got two screws. And just like that, we've got an enhanced drill crafting. I couldn't make more, but I forget what the rewards were for the glow, craw glow crawler scutes, but I feel like it wasn't bad. So I'm just going to save those. I feel like one drill is going to be good enough to just test it around with. But we're going to have to save that for the next episode because I need to give my voice a break right now. And uh, we've already been at this for a while. We've done a lot. And we've we set out exactly what we meant to accomplish. We found the, what the glow crawlers are all about and completed a bunch of quests and got a bunch of chemicals. That could actually, uh, the chemicals can actually provide explosions for this drill that we just made. Let's see how big it is. Whoa, it's actually bigger than I was expecting. Okay, looking forward to that. All right, make sure you guys are subscribed so you don't miss the next episode. If you guys enjoyed this, you'll probably enjoy some more that you can find right here on the end screen. Hope this video did earn your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.